are you? Has this bowl game lead up been different than the normal? No, you know, uh, I think last year we had a really good uh, regimen. Coach Stoops has really just kind of followed that and stuck to it this year. And I think we're going to go into the game, you know, start off hot like we did last year. It, it, it feels like there's been a little bit more talking than normal yeah. um, going into the game. What Can you expand on that at all? Or? Yeah, I have nothing to say about that whatsoever. I'm not the one talking. If they want to talk, it doesn't really bother me whatsoever. So obviously we'll, we'll handle it on the field. Do, do you all get a little bit more juice from that? Yeah, you know, it hypes people up, and that's they, that's what they want to do. That's what gets them going. That's fine. It doesn't really bother me. I'm, uh, I get my, uh, my motivation elsewhere. So. It w is part of that just going out with with the win? Exactly, yeah. You know, just out there for my brothers and leaving that lasting legacy on this team and really going out a winner. Now, they talk a lot about Virginia Tech, lunch pail defense. It's mm -hmm. Bud Foster's last game. Yeah. What, what, what does that mean? Like, what is that when you see it on film? What is that? Yeah, nothing but respect for uh, Coach Foster's defense. You know, really good uh, historically. And so we're excited to go and see how our offense matches up against theirs. And uh, I think we're going to do all right. So, in, in name, it's like a four-two-five defense, right? Mm -hmm. And I think was it Austin P the second to last game, or who, I forget what team that was, the FCS team. Yes, they ran some weird four-two-five stuff. Did they give y'all looks from that game to this one that are kind of similar? Yeah, the thing about it is, if uh, I think if they're going to be moving around a lot, and if we can uh, capitalize on that movement and cut them deep early, I think I mean that's all they're going to be able to do. You know, I mean, what are they going to do play his head up? I mean, I don't think that's going to happen. So. They're going to really have to uh, either shift and blitz off the edge and really get us on our toes. But uh, I'm excited to see what they do. For you, uh, it's a big game for getting to that next level. How, how is it just hit what I see when it's there? Or do you have to, to kind of like, all right, this is my guy. I got to, no matter which way he moves, I've got to get him. Yeah, I mean, different schemes call for different blocking techniques. So, I mean, sometimes we're doing full zone, sometimes we're manned up. It really depends on what play we're running and what we're trying to do with the ball. But is this one of those where you're like, all right, I'm getting downfield and putting head on helmet a lot? Yeah, I mean, we're definitely, you know, I'm not changing my play up by any means. So uh, we'll, yeah. it'll be the same play you've seen all year. So what, what, what's your, do you got like a checklist for this last game or are you just ready to go out and pop some pads? I'm ready to pop some pads. You know, I don't go in with too many expectations except for getting that win. So that's all we're looking for.